how to move the custom crosser, just move it. It's super easy, you just move it. You move it. It's super easy, you just move it. Now, if you open your paint.net and you, like, um, you take a screenshot by hitting your print screen button on your keyboard, which is the PS on my keyboard right here. Um, if you do that, if you have more than one monitor, um, okay, so what you do is once you, once you hit the print screen button, um, you have to make sure you're deployed and stuff, but you'll see your crosshair right in there in the middle. Hit the print screen button, and then go to your paint.net. Um, let me turn off my crosshair real quick, just for, um, demonstration purposes. But if you do control V, and you hit this expand canvas button, or whatever, uh, it'll pop up this, which obviously I have two monitors, so it's going to pop up like this. But if you have two monitors, you should be able to scroll in all the way to the bottom here. All the way to the very bottom of that, and you should be able to come up here. Then once you do that, you hit control X, which cuts that. And then you hit come here to file, then you hit new. And make sure that's your screen resolution right there. Then you hit OK. Then you paste. And if you scroll in by doing control and zooming in, you should be able to come here to your crosshair. And you can edit it however you please. Now, what you should do when you want to edit it, what you should do is you should hit this add new layer button. And make sure your layers up here are added. Then you can customize it. So like if I wanted this to be red instead, I can just grab the pencil and paint it like this. And if you hit Control z it'll undo. Yeah. And then, then once you do that, you, you, you come here, you select this layer, the, the arsenal layer, and you delete that. And you gotta make sure you're drawing on the second layer, otherwise it'll delete that too. But yeah, once that's done, you should be able to hit, um, Control s here. And then... If you come here to your overlay, your where your over, crosshair overlay file is, wherever it is, and you just select on the overlay.png, and then you hit save, and uh, you should be good.